And what about the flight paths? Because we talked about, I, I remember reading that it would have to be something like, what did I say? It was like 3,000 3, miles, sorry, 3,000 feet per every minute, the nose of the plane would have to dip. Right? This is like a significant um, effort for the flight. But then we also have the actual geography of flight paths that many people have devoted themselves to yeah. uh, really studying, right? And that don't make sense on a globe. So think of think uh, you know about a globe. Uh, we got the northern hemisphere on the top, the southern hemisphere on the bottom. You got the horizon that goes around the midpoint. If you were going from any location in the north to any location in the north, any two locations, any combination, and you were flying, would you ever need to dip below the horizon? No, that wouldn't be the shortest path. I mean, okay. north to north, you would never need to go below the horizon because that's you're going the wrong way. You want to go, you can maybe go across the horizon or over this way, but you would never go below the horizon. And guess what? That's true. No northern origin goes to a northern destination and crosses the equator, right? Makes perfect logical sense. Well, the same should be true for the bottom, a southern location to another southern location. But that's not what happens. <laughs> you know, when we, on the, on the southern trips, we have, we go all the way up here. And then all the way back down, right? And that's because, where is that? Uh, Se Seattle? What am I looking at? I can't see it. Um, um, the, but the, the stopover, hold on. The stopover in Singal, okay? It stops in Singal right here, right? It goes all the way up here. Why didn't it just fly across here, right? And they give you this, oh, it's a great circle route, or we're picking up more passengers. Nonsense. These people want to go here. And this is a straight line. They cross, this blue line is the equator. They cross the equator twice. That makes no sense on a globe, okay? Here's another one. Um, to this, this one stops in Los Angeles, okay? From here, right? It goes all the way up here to Los Angeles and all the way back down. Now, look at this strip. This flight, what if we just went off here? Oh, look, we, we made it to where we're going. But no. This is the path. They stop to get fuel. It's a long flight. Right? Which one makes more sense to you? And there's many, many examples of this, right? Many, I mean, many, many. So I'm going to yeah, yeah, yeah. So this one, again, stopping in Los Angeles, looking at on a flat Earth map, makes perfect total sense. Um, but then there's emergency flights, emergency landing. Sometimes someone's having a baby or a heart attack, and uh, they have to land. So this flight here from Hawaii to New York, or New York to Hawaii, um, there was an emergency right about here. So they went a thousand plus miles out of the way to Seattle. And the funny thing is, how did they get there so fast? Emergency, they landed 15 minutes later. How did they travel a thousand miles? Okay. Well, if you look at it, Seattle's right there. That's where the emergency happened. They landed. Okay. And that, that's not planned. So here's another one. They, this, this one went... Emergency went all the way up to Moscow. Why did they go to Moscow? Because Moscow is right there on the flight path, on the direct straight line between the two of them, right? Let's look at another one. Dallas, Beijing um, stops in Calgary. I don't know. Is that 2,000 miles out of the way? Okay, 1,500 miles. Look at Calgary, right in line, straight line. How many times does that have to happen before somebody says, um, you know, oh, my God. But here's the thing. I just showed you some memes. If you believe me, well, that's a leap of faith. You're right to believe me because I've done the research for you. But belief is the enemy of knowing. You need to verify this stuff for yourself. And luckily for you, Eddie Flat Earth Banjo, who you probably know, know of, um, he's documented it all in this free PDF book, or you can order the book online, um, 16 Emergency Landings, all documented. The, 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 the flight pass, the times, what happened, where they landed, um, everything. And so you can verify it yourself. There you go. Amazing. Yeah. Amazing.